This is how the canyon was made, okay? The water you see me have here is the rainstorms we get during monsoon season. Monsoon season would come around with a storm. It would wet the soil. The soil here would absorb it. The sand you see me grab here is the wind. The wind would repeat this process over and over again. This is how we get new layers. So that was the second layer, third layer, the fourth layer. So this is how we keep getting new layers added onto each other. So when you guys look at the sandstone just right here, that's how it's layer on top of layer on top of layer. And this is the last time right here. It gets absorbed. The wind comes by again. And that's done. So now when the wind comes through again, it blows the sand away, but it leaves the sandstone. So when you guys are coming to Page, Arizona, you guys saw a lot of rocks like this, huh? Like a big boulder or like a small stud. This is how it happens. So the next part, you guys see this crack? So when the Colorado Plateau shifted, it cracked the sandstone here. So this entire pathway for the flash flood was already here. When the Colorado shifted, it cracked the sandstone. The water went through that crack, eroding away into what we have now. So this is the same rain that we get from the well, that made the layers. Now it's the flash floods. Okay, the flash floods will go through the crack. Wow! This is such a cool experiment. Yes. Just like that. That's how we get all these different slot canyons here. Some of these slot canyons, they're the exact opposite of this. If you guys go to Upper Canyon, it's not like this. This entire structure would be upside down. If you guys want, you can pick it up. This is great. Thank you. Yeah, go for it. It's great. Total touch environment. This is awesome. Yeah, we're all done, guys. You guys ready?